Okay, next topic is to discuss the intercostal vans and their topography. Vans for vein, artery, and nerve. And so we're going to identify the following. Topography of intercostal vans within the intercostal spaces. Oh, cool. All right. So here in this picture um, is a section through the thoracic wall. So let's get ourselves oriented. So some happy faces. There's skin. And underlying the skin is the hypodermis. And then that's like primarily adipose tissue. And then there's a rib. And then this other pink tissue is showing the lung. So all that lung tissue which is surrounded by their pleural membranes, parietal pleura near the ribs, and visceral pleura adhering to the uh, lungs themselves. And so here we now have a rib, and here we have a rib. And so in between we have, shing, the intercostal space, where the word inter stands for between, or means between, and the word costal means rib. So the intercostal space is literally the space between the ribs. And so what do we have in between that space? Intercostal muscles, where we have an external intercostal muscle and an internal intercostal muscle and an innermost intercostal muscle. And then we have between the internal innermost intercostal muscles an intercostal vein, an intercostal artery, and an intercostal nerve in that order. V-A-N, vein, artery, nerve, or van. Shing, there we have intercostal van. And so what is the topography of the intercostal vans? Well, they're coursing between the internal and innermost intercostal muscles. Plus, what we see here, ghosted through the bone, you can see the blue, red, and yellow structures in the costal groove, which is this groove on the bottom of the rib. Now, we now take this little section through the rib, and now you see that the rib is removed. You can see the van coursing on the bottom of the rib, which is called the costal groove, the bottom of the rib. So the intercostal van, in a nutshell, what do we have is the following. Well, the intercostal van course between the internal and innermost intercostal muscles within the inferior border of the associated rib. For example, the right fifth intercostal van courses through the right fifth intercostal space under the partial cover of the right fifth rib. And there's intercostal van topography in a nutshell.